Every Thursday in our series, A More Perfect Union, we aim to show that what unites us as Americans is greater than what divides us. Remember that. Well, this morning we take you to the streets of Medford, Massachusetts, and that's where a plan to improve driver safety with this optical illusion could potentially save countless lives. Vladimir Dutier of our streaming network CBSN introduces us to the 10-year-old behind the idea. Drivers on the road can often be dangerously distracted. I've seen people just speed past stop signs, speed past crosswalks, and people are like, could get really injured. So 10-year-old Issa and her classmate Eric came up with a plan just outside their school that would make drivers look twice. It is an illusion painted on the ground to look like actual object. The idea came from a close call Eric's brother had when he was crossing the street. And through their research, they found illusions like these are a worldwide trend. 3D crosswalks are popping up in places like Iceland, Germany, and Beijing. It comes at a time the number of accidents in the U.S. involving pedestrians is rising. In 2017, more than 193,000 pedestrians were injured in crashes. They were really concerned about safety for their uh, fellow students. The fourth graders turned to Medford Mayor Stephanie Burke, who now hopes to take the idea to every school in the district. Books don't teach you this. Civic engagement um, is something that you just, you see happen, you see success, and then you try to emulate it and do more. ISA is part of the Center for Citizenship and Social Responsibility, an organization that encourages young people to get involved in the community. Mike Coates is an advisor for the center. This is a great example of, of them sticking to an idea and going through all the steps and talking, in this case, to all the adults and the powers that be. While it took a year to get the green light, Issa is hoping to get these 3D walkways on the roads everywhere. Hope it works. <laughs> I'm very excited. <laughs> Go, Isa. Yeah. yeah. Something tells me it would work. But it is interesting how a little kid can see something and say, I can do something about that. Right. Yes. And then it just and requires an, a listening adult. That's yeah. right. You, know, you don't always get those. Yeah. Let the children lead. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>